share. This is Lana's and Shannon Sky. Welcome. Please hit like and subscribe for a chance to win a free reading, hypnosis, or whatever I do. Yes, I'm outside. You can probably hear my chickens, my my roosters crowing. <laughs> I, have, I have little tiny ones. They're like this big. <laughs> um, please also visit EnchantedSky.com. You can book a reading with me. Um, I did have somebody that was attempting to snipe um, and scam people. Um, if you ever get a an email saying you want a free reading and it's not coming in from EnchantedSky.com, Please disregard it and be careful. I will always give some type of code that you will know that you have run one you're reading. Okay? So be careful out there. Anybody's trying to get anything from you and it's not probably not me. Pay attention because it, everyone saw it. Nobody got taken, thank God. And I did get them shut down in 24 hours. So here's your joke of the day, by the way. Did you hear, did you know that, that French fries are not, they were, they've never been made in France. They can't be. They're made in Greece. Blessings. Hey there, Sag Cap. The cusp of prophecy. <laughs> This is mine. You guys know that, though. You do know that I am the same sign you are. So let's see what we get this month. Um, had a lot, of, had a tower card involved this whole month, last month. So let's see if we're reaping that benefit of that tower. Remember, tower cards aren't always bad. Oh, that fell out. Oh, see? Look, job <laughs> or opportunity. Ooh, and something is hidden. Ooh, there's been work done, but not enough. Ooh, money. Be patient. Uh, you're not using your intuition like you should be. Okay, ooh, there's a man offering you something. And hmm, things aren't going as fast as you would like them to go. Okay. You better make your decisions. Okay, so so that you understand what's going on, I am a Sag Cup. I am a Sag Cap. Also, there is a job offer. There is an offer that's coming to you, and they're they're urging you not to blow it. Okay, I'm gonna be. That's exactly what's what this reading is about. All right, they're telling you to walking. You're walking a thin mile, and maybe you should heal. Take some time for yourself. Heal. There's gonna be some really hard stuff you're going to have to learn. You're going to have to work really hard at it, but end it, end something. You know, they're telling you not to go overboard, but see, look at, and it's upside down. There's going to be, I want to, I don't want to say a tiff, but it's like, you don't know which way to go. And you're thinking you might've gone the wrong way. And in the long run, no, it's not. Now make your choice and make it and stick with, see, look at, that's your choice. That's your surroundings. That means yes, 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 yes. So if you are still waiting to hear from a job and you had gotten that tower card in July, now is in August and they want you to go forward. See, look at, somebody's bringing you a couple of, somebody's bringing you an opportunity. And the way you thought you were going this whole time is not the way it actually ends up being. So they're telling you to let go of something. What do you have to let go of? All right, what are you chained to? You chained to a person? You chained to a job? You chained to money? What are you, what are you chained to? This can also represent a bad habit. Spending too much? A porn? It represents a lot of stuff. It's the devil. Now, this is, this is a very interesting card because when I see this card and I'm asking about a person, if I see that they're evil and they really are the devil because they're doing bad something that's to hurt other people, then I see that card. Okay. I, I asked one time if this person was talking bad about me and was spreading rumors, and I got that card. I'm like, oh, oh, yeah, they are. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> so just remember that. Now, there is a man with, of money involved, a king of pentacles, which could be a, or an earth sign. So it could be you, okay, because you're, you're Sag Cap. Cap, Taurus, Virgo. This doesn't look bad. I mean, you, your surroundings with money, with an offer, are yes, yes, yes. Just be patient. I kind of feel like some of you guys are getting really super impatient about something. 
So maybe there's an offer coming and they're doing interviews and it's just taken a freaking long time. <laughs> and you're like, oh my God. Okay. So be patient and wait it out because it's still hidden. I want to say, now I know that in my chart, I am in transits and I have six of them right now. And I know they're in my area of career. So I know that they're there. If you don't know what this means, call me and make an appointment because I am not an expert, but I can look at some of it. And if I, I also have people that I know that I might refer you to. If you want to know if you're in transit, okay? What a transit means, you're in a huge change. It's, it's, going, it's in your favor, okay? So just remember that, all right? Let's see what we get from our oracle cards. These, by the way, are the Moonology, and I love them. I've always loved these. Um, I will leave a link for you. So if you want to buy them, because I just like them. They're, they're very, fairly common deck. So, okay. A personal issue reads, reaches resolution. So you're going to get this job. It's something's going. Somebody's bringing you something. And you're afraid or you're, you're, you're afraid to let go of something else to get this. Just remember that. It's time to take action. And they don't want you sitting around. So if the offer comes, take it. A new start, see, look at, a new start is coming. A new you, very much so. You're letting, trying to let go. What's the monkey on your back? Look at the bigger picture. Stand back and watch. I have found that that, that really, really helps me making decisions. I stand back, try as hard as I can, because we all know this is almost impossible to read for yourself, to stand back and try to take your emotion out of it. Sometimes you can read for yourself. Um, of late, and the, because of the, la the shifts that are going on right now, I've been reading maybe 20 to 30% right for myself, but that's about it. Where my, whereas for somebody else, I'm more like 90%, but I can't, you just can't. Um, anybody that says that they can is full of garbage because you just are too emotionally involved and you can't see clearly. Okay, so just remember that. But I, I'm telling you, there, there is a new start. That's a new start, and they're going to offer you. So if you're looking for a job and you had those interviews, you're going to get the offer. And it says, yes, yes, yes. Your dreams need a practical plan. The bigger picture, what is it? What is it? What's your dream? The end of a tough, tough cycle approaches. You know, you deserve this. I know on my chart, in my astrological chart, I just, it, it's, I'm in transit financially and I'm in transit um, uh, job-wise. There's something else going on. Now, I know I'm getting ready to retire and I know that and you guys all know that. But there's something else and I will fill you guys in because I already know what it is. And I see that that's interesting. I thought for sure I'd get offered it in July unless I start in August. That could be what this is too. Letting go of the fact that I was a teacher for 30 years because it's something else. Okay. Could be something like that. Think about it. Let me know. Blessings to all you guys. And this, yes, yes, yes. It's in your surroundings. So go for it. Blessings.